welcome back so guys we are continuing our react js e-commerce series and now guys in this video we are going to learn how to show the subtotal and grand total price guys so over here when you increment or decrement your value as it is changing over here we want to show the grand total of this all items okay so guys let's get started so let's move to our react app okay and this is our card.js guys so let's move below to the design so this is our html over here let's design the column guys over here class name where i'm going to use column md8 and same way copy and paste and use four so inside this we are going to create one card so class name is equal to card where card body and margin top three guys inside this we will use h4 tag to show the subtotal and grand total so let's type subtotal colon and start with span tag give the class name where you'll mention float end and the price will be something like this okay so let's copy and paste once again this will be a grand total all set and one horizontal row guys where and with this and a simple link so let's use link okay close two is equal to where you'll go to checkout page so we have to create a checkout page we'll see in next video checkout and design this button guys using class of button primary done now let's see the output guys for this first refresh okay so we have got the design guys and now let's get the subtotal and grand total so both are going to be the same value we have to just calculate this so let's move to this loop so where is it here cart html let's move it over here and this is the table guys and inside this table row we have looped the data so over here only before the return we have to calculate let's create a variable called total cart price plus equal to where i want the product price and the cart product quantity so item dot product table dot the selling price okay multiplied by the cart table product quantity column okay all set now let's copy this variable guys total cart price and you have to create a variable so let's move top okay where total price is equal to zero so we are going to initialize with zero and now wherever you want you can just print that values so let's go below at the subtotal paste that's it guys so if you if you are included gst or any tax and all you can just calculate over here and just send that that's it guys so yep let's see the output now you can see perfect so 30000 it's shown let me just decrement you can see 12 plus 9 is equal to 21 so 21000 everything is working fine guys and now in this video that's it guys so let's continue next video to create checkout page and sim data fields to place the order so thank you for watching this video please subscribe like and share